The whole thing is wool. The eyes, the teeth, her pearls are wool. The hair is wool. It has a softness to it that speaks to who she is. And yet, when you felt wool, it becomes really strong. My name is Rosemary Pellaquin. I'm an artist and I live in a small town called Saint-Pierre-Jolie and I make sculptures out of wool and also do two-dimensional pieces. When I first started, I felt like I wanted to put some faces out there and show how lovely they are. And wool is so nice to show that. You can't be sad when you're surrounded by clouds of wool. <laughs> it's just, it feels so good. <laughs> What it's brought me to do is to meet all these great shepherds. They are amazing. Their knowledge of their sheep and their breeding, it's wonderful because I know that they love what they're doing. They care for the animals. The one shepherd that I go to in Carberry, Manitoba, she has award-winning wool and she breeds rare breeds and her program just comes up with this, this unique quality wool that artisans use. You can actually know the name of the sheep that you're getting the wool from that goes into your pieces. I mean there's a connection there. There are a lot more farmers in, in Manitoba and, and in Canada. They're building up the industry and they're all very community-minded people. They're big into sustainability and making sure that they take care of their animals and have quality wool. To be a part of that makes me feel good. Supporting industries that are sustainable is an opportunity to make our lives better. We all know about having our clothing made out of wool, but to use it in an art form and every other way is absolutely creative. But that's the whole thing about being creative, about how we use natural fibers. They're there forever and they benefit so much. Environmentally, the land, our homes, beautification. I think it's amazing. The Jubilee is a celebration of Her Majesty's 70 years of reign. Not too many people get to be in service for 70 years. A lot of people would like to live that long. It's very important to celebrate the good things with everything going on in the world. And in this case, celebrating not just Her Majesty and the Campaign for Wool, but the whole supply chain. It's such an honor to be asked to make this piece for Her Majesty's Jubilee. What I did with Her Majesty was to research her. Looked at a lot of photos, listened to a lot of her speeches, what she said, what she believes, how she uh, interacts with people, and what I saw was a joyful, kind, hardworking person. And yes, she's you know, Her Majesty and an icon. She's also a woman, a working woman. She's been working for 70 years at this job. She's a mother, she's a grandmother. So all of that, it goes into the piece. And what I try and do is get the essence of the person. And to me, it was that, that joyful smile and the twinkle in the eye. It portrays how I feel she is as, as, a, as a woman, as the monarch, as, you know, after all these years of living and of, of working uh, at something that she loves and for people that she serves. And isn't it great that I get to serve her in this way? <laughs>